Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So finally, we've gone here. It's been 3,000 miles in about one week and we're finally at the Florida Keys. We're actually on our way to Key West. The difference between Key West and the Florida Keys aren't the same thing. Key West is one of many keys or islands that make up the Florida Keys. The Keys, as they are sometimes known, is an extensive archipelago that spans the ocean for a total of 125 miles southwest bound from Miami. Seas Highway. This is a long stretch on the way to Key West. If you look, you can see ocean on both sides. This is a long, long stretch of highway. And along the way, we're going to be able to see people that are boating and people that are fishing and people just enjoying themselves, which is what Key West is known for. So beautiful and so panoramic. RV place called Blue Water Keys. It's a luxury resort and uh, you see we're all hooked up now and we got a television, we got a little cabana, we got a table and chairs and we're just going to hang out for a while and see what kind of amenities they have. So we're spending the rest of our vacation, the end of our vacation in the Florida Keys.
why we're at Blue Water Keys and we're going to be walking the park. So I'm going to kind of show you the amenities, what the park looks like. So we also got our dogs with us. So let's go. Luxury RV Resort. Uh, you see a lot of big uh, class A's here. And if you look over here, you get a little cabana, you get a, a sink, a bar, and these people actually have an you know, oceanfront uh, spot, so it's pretty cool. So this is the RV spot, similar like us, but they have a ocean view. More like canal than ocean, right? What do you think, babe? Yeah. It's, it's more like a more like canal. Ah, uh, see. Hi. Okay, swim at your own risk. It's pretty scary to swim here. Yeah. Yeah. And these are for boats, so boats. Yeah. They say it's only 1.5 feet, babe. Yeah, I heard it's shallow. Yeah, they say it's shallow. You're not going to sink in there, though. It's dirty. It's murky. Yeah, you can see the bottom. Yeah. Oh, there's fish in there. So this is an area behind our RV spot. Looks like they have some water here. Um, got some boats. It's pretty shallow. Um, maybe just a few feet. Doesn't look very high. I actually see fish inside. So I'm not sure if you can eat the fish, but maybe go fishing. Um, but this is like a little water area that they have um, right behind. And there is a beach on the other side, but we didn't get access to that. But this is like the water water area they have. They're mostly boats. And, Say swim at your own risk, which is kind of weird when they say that. <laughs> You see a lot of wildlife here. We saw an iguana, we've seen a bunch of salamanders, and who knows what else we're gonna see is because we're still gonna be here for three days.
the keys, the homemade lunch, we have some spaghetti, uh, meat, sauce, and onions. So a nice little lunch and our comfortable little cabana. We got our cold water and of course our new favorite, we have this ghost pepper sauce that we use on everything now. <laughs> so here we go. This feels very relaxing. It's uh, with the family. Uh, the weather's kind of cool. It's a little humid, but once you're under the cabana, it's actually really cool. So this is a nice, relaxing vacation in the Florida Keys. I'm going to show you a little bit about our RV. Um, we are going to show you a video a little bit later if you stay tuned about what we saw when we purchased the RV. So let me give you a little tour. Uh, this is a Freedom Elite. It's a Thor model, uh, 22 FE, and it's a 24 foot. If you look over here, we have three cabinets on the top. That's a window. They also gave us little side windows. You have also some cabinets on the top here. You have a drawer here, and you also have some connections, a USB and outlets on the side for you to plug in your phones or whatever else you need to plug into. All right, so now we start exiting. Uh, okay, this is the dining area, okay? You have a table, and this table actually drops into a bed. So you fold these down, and you can have yourself a bed. Uh, we have two uh, windows here that slide out three cabinets and we also have an opening cabinet with a mirror that connects into the adjacent room so you can get it from both sides we have a top bunk here good for kids as you can see it has a nice little vent up there you also have a side light and a place this is actually this tv actually came with the rv so you can get a little tv here all the hookups are up here that will help you work with the TV and the USB. This is our kitchen area. We've got a nice little sink here with a faucet. They have multiple drawers. You got four drawers and they all snap shut, open. We have our stove that lifts up. Uh, oven. We got another drawer here. And then we have a microwave, the Greystone microwave. And they also give you a little cabinet on top here. This is our refrigerator. So we have our refrigerator here. And a freezer on top. We always make sure that we snap it shut so when you drive it doesn't pop out. And then you got another kind of container here. And we actually put um, trash. our trash in And then you have a little here on the bottom. So we 
have a bathroom inside, and you have a shower. Uh, I'll step in just to kind of give you the height and dimension. All right, I'm 6'4", so if you look, I'm barely here, but they do have a little light here that gives you a little more room. As you see, I'm banging my head, so it's pretty high. They give you the nozzle here, so at least it's movable, so at least you can move it around wherever you need it. Multiple places to put accessories there. And then you step out, the toilet. It's kind of a nice little countertop. You have a cabinet on top, <coughs> and then you have another one on the bottom too to put uh, whatever bath accessories you need. As well as lights and a vent, which is nice, you know, for when people go to the toilet. Open the cabinet. And then you also have another cabinet here. Supply. So all your bathroom supplies are handy. Go. This is the tour of the interior of our Freedom Elite Thor 22FE 24 foot RV and stay tuned to more videos. So if you need some more information we're going to be putting a video on uh, in the future that's going to talk a little bit more about um, the, Thor, the Freedom Elite RV. So thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and look forward to our next destination which is also the Florida Keys. So another spot. Bye for now.